Which hostels do you think is the best? 146 crore freshly sourced at IIT Madras or newly constructed hotel like hostels at IIT Bombay? IIT Mess, where you can order the food you like or the new messes at IIT Bombay. The college which has Asia's biggest cultural festival or the college which is building some of the sophisticated tech for the nation. So in IIT Madras, when the freshie comes, he has to share his room with two people. So that means this is a three sharing oh. room. And when they go to second year and third year, they have to share their room. Okay, like we only have double occupancy till third year and in our final year, we have single occupancy. Same in IIT Madras also. Here's the fact. The first year hostel at IIT Madras is way good compared to IIT Bombay. It has badminton court, kitchen, billiards, library, TV room, basketball court, volleyball court and much more. To be noted, the total cost of constructing precious hostel at IIT Madras is 146 crores. But things get challenging when you move to the hostels of second year or third years at IIT Bombay because the room size is so small. That is the famous thing about H5. <laughs> like whatever he speaks, we can hear it. Hear it, okay and you have to share it with two persons. But when it comes to the final year hostels at IIT Bombay, hands down, no dispute, they are the best. They have all the facilities except the basketball and volleyball court of the newly constructed Freshies Hostel at IIT Madras. And the best part is, it is single sharing. Hostel. And one more great thing is like the messes will be in the hostel itself. Here the hostels are something like hostel 1 to hostel 18. Each hostel has their own mess. But in IIT Madras, it is not the case. We'll talk in detail about the mess food in the next session. But comfort wise, IIT Bombay hostels is the best. Do you have a movie after your hostel fight? We, fight. we do have. <laughs> In 2019, under the direction of Nitesh Chivari, with Sushant Singh Rajput and Sharda Kapra as leading act, Chichore was released. And it's a massive hit. The story revolves around the inter hostel Sports Championship at IIT Bombay and the fights associated with it. But here is a fact. The director of the movie, also the director of Dunkal, was an alumni at IIT Bombay. And talking of inter hostel Championship, every IIT I was aware of has inter hostel Championship and in IIT Madras, we name it Schreiter. And this movie is fiction, but the movie is so good, I literally cried while watching the movie. But I think this actually doesn't contribute to the quality of students living at IIT. So we are going to ignore this. So considering all the pluses and minuses, so the hostels is a tie. Now at this point, it's not fair if you miss IIT Delhi into the picture. You know, in IIT Madras, IIT Bombay, there is this thing that girls can come into boys hostel. Especially in IIT Bombay, boys can't get into girls hostel. So is it also the same case? So at IIT Delhi, undergraduates are not allowed to go to the girls hostel and girls are also not allowed to the boys hostel but there are two hostels at IIT Delhi those are very new hostels that's they are called uh, Ronagri and Saptagiri those two hostels are co-ed hostels co-ed hostel are just rocking it. Yeah, for postgraduates, not for us. By the way, if you're wondering how to join for postgraduates at IIT's gate exam is the way. And if you are someone who is seriously preparing for gate exam, currently in an academy, there is a learning festival is going on. You will get free access to gate plus subscription for seven days, which includes all online and live lectures, study material curated by top educators, practice questions, mock test and PYQs with 24-7 doubt support. The enrollment ends on April 4. Do check it out. Coming back, like other IITs, in IIT Delhi, final year students are getting single sharing with getting single sharing in third year. Also, the messes at IIT Delhi attach with the hostel. It is of comfort and out of the three IITs, the internet speed at IIT Delhi is the highest. And they have a sharing hostel. So as a PG student, I have to give 1.2 IIT Delhi as well. Now, you might be wondering why am I keeping this course? Because either IIT Bombay or IIT Delhi wins, I'll give 1000 rupees. Then definitely I'm gonna get 1000 rupees and IIT Delhi will be blin. Now, this is the part I was so excited to talk about. Mess, mess to and everything following up the campus life at IIT. The way the mess it works, a student can choose whether he wants non veg or veg, that is one thing. Whether he wants to go with South Indian or North Indian. So the students will have an opportunity to choose what kind of food preference he Let's wants. Let's say he decides to choose with North Indian. The particular hostel will provide food only North dishes they will do. So like we have individual messes for all the hostels. You told like you have the preference to choose North Indian or South Indian. We don't have any such choices. But we do get uh, food both for North Indian people and uh, South Indian people. It's kind of a mix of both the things. Hey, mess food wise, we are better because we are. <laughs> and and, and I, I'll say one more thing. Like we do have one where they will credit your mess fees that you are giving for the semester. We have the luxury of eat whatever we want. Obvious. It's like a hotel. Your ID card is your credit card and you can swipe and you can do whatever you want. That's, that's crazy, man. This, this facility is 
way more than better than any IIT I think so no need for discuss anything more mess facility wise IIT Madras wins by the way if you are wondering how the mess will be in IIT Delhi it is similar to IIT Bombay the point for mess food is IIT Madras wins now the next is which college has better campus and campus life we have two lakes around the campus we have a hill that is within the campus we have a beautiful lakeside view like where you can connect there what else do you need so uh, even in IIT Madras also we do have lake and IIT Madras is very close to nature you can see deers cats monkeys all these animals roam like their own territory and majority of IIT Madras is actually a forest so you won't feel like that you are in Chennai yeah so if we talk about nature and uh, all these things like lakes and all so that's not here Mm. Here we can only see peacock. Peacock is the only thing we can see. Classify the happenings like let's say uh, how often the entertainments will happen here at IIT Bombay. So I will tell our part like so we do have a theater. <laughs> And that is so much bigger than the O80 that was at IIT Bombay. Where a student can buy a membership card for two forty rupees for six months. Using that, we can watch a movie every single week for free. That was being screened at O80. <laughs> And it's so cool because sometimes the rain will come. You will be like watching the movie in uh, under an umbrella. Every Saturday, Sunday, there will be some fest all over going on. And how is the fest that will happen here? We have like different kind of festivals as well. Like Mood Indigo is there, Tech Fest is there, yeah. Esel so having their biggest event. We do have our Sastra festival. That is a Tech festival. We have our Esel festival. And we have Sarangas Cultural Festival. If you are bad, I am your guide. Currently, right now, a fest going on, which is called Trist, which is the, one of the biggest tech fest of the North India. We have a separate fest for analysis. Okay. We have a separate okay. fest for every department. We have a separate fest for every club as well. Placement cell has their own fest. Even in their sports fest also, they do stand up arts and make it big. Hands down, no dispute. Fest means I did Delhi. So one point to I did Delhi. Now before moving on to my favorite part and to know whether Chichore movie Just moments actually happening at IITs right now, it's worth talking about which IITs has best placement. Now I know you are thinking about IIT Bombay, but you are wrong because in the last two years, the number of students placed in IIT Madras is higher than IIT Bombay. Best placement season. Ever. Let me tell you why. Also, I was trying to understand when did the trend of placements meet IIT Bombay started. Let me tell you what I found. First of all, is IIT Bombay the first established IIT? The answer is nope. Long before independence, IIC was the only renowned institute in India. Which was established in 1909. Later, the leaders of our nation realizes the country should not depend more on capital than on technology. So after we got independence at year 1950, the first Indian institute was established at Karakpur. And since it was in West Bengal and they wanted the institutes to be established all around the country, in 1958, IIT Bombay was established, and in 1959. IIT Madras and IIT Kanpur was established and in 1961 IIT Delhi these are the first five IITs of the nation then after nearly 35 years only IIT Guwahati was founded and then so on so so one thing noted here is history was not clear is IIT Bombay was the first choice for students when it comes to join the IITs but tracking back the records from 2005 on an average 61 jwe toppers in the top 100 is joining to iit bombay with more than 40 je toppers in top 50 rankers prefers iit bombay and in the year 2022 and 2023 in the top 50 rankers 46 rankers join iit bombay and the main reason is you know what placements Bombay has better placements over other IITs, and one of the reason Bombay has better placement over other IITs is Bombay is the financial capital of India, which attracts more employers. Location value is really high to IIT Bombay than any other IITs. And guess what? IIT Bombay has become consistently ranked first in employer reputation for many years and leading the placement stats. Every year, even during COVID in the year 2020-2021 placements, the most number of accepted job offers in India was from IIT Bombay, with 1150 students, and the highest placement package is also from IIT Bombay, which is 1.5 crores. In the same year, at IIT Madras, the number is less. The number of students placed was 1047, and the highest package is 82.5 lakhs per annum. Here's the thing: what really puzzled me was. 
the trend started to change post covid in the academic year 2021 2022 the total number of accepted offers at iit madras is 1491 with an average salary of 21.48 lakhs per annum and the highest salary is 1.98 crore and in the same year the total number of accepted offers at iit bombay is 1431 with an average salary of 21.82 lakhs per annum and the highest salary is 2.1 crore per annum so in the giving package wise iit bombay is slightly better and in the academic year 2020 2023 the placement at iit madras really saw a surge in stats with the total number of students at iit madras placed is 1612 with an average package of 22.7 lakhs per annum and with the highest salary of 1.31 crore and in iit bombay the total number of accepted offers is 1516 with an average salary of 21.82 lakhs per annum but the highest placement package was like so huge it was like 3.67 crore it's kind of a three times lesser to iit madras it is like you know now let's move on to the chichore moments at iits department league that is called ideal okay. they have inter hostel league which okay. is called striter and they will give medals and they will give global championships and they do have something called pg championship where the post graduate students yes, yes. Uh, uh, yes we do have that thing as well like yeah. pg and ug thing so there is that one more thing that will happen and apart from that odd semester we conduct something called sports fest where we will invite the teams from chennai and uh, we will actually play in the even semester there we used to conduct one tournament called gerald fisher which is like we will invite the best teams in india and as i mentioned before in iit delhi sports fest is really big we call celebrities we call stand up comedians in that yeah so these are some of the events that will happen and i think in performance wise we are definitely dominating this year because in the 55th inter iit which was held at iit bombay and gandhinagar iit madras secured the most gold and medals and won the 56th inter iit global championship iit madras <laughs> So yeah, I would like uh, appreciate that thing. But uh, having said that, but like IIT Bombay has good sports culture as well, yes. and uh, people are playing different sports, and they are doing really well as well. Hands down, there is no disputes in special uh, four sports facilities base. I was here. We do have basketball courts, we do have volleyball courts, but here the volleyball courts and basketball courts they are providing it indoor. Even table tennis shuttle we do have indoor, but uh, additionally I feel like uh, the courts are actually. indoor here i've been to iit delhi i played in madras hands down the sports facilities at iit bombay is actually better compared to these two iits so why is this video for you make it to iit bombay or whether you will make it to iit uh, madras uh, your life is going to be amazing you are going to cherish the life that you are going to have here so work hard whether you are working for je gate uh, jam phd anything you are working for it work hard and you will going to love the life that you will have here But I see the light from far away it's down the line maybe I should not give up without a fight